Hello Internet. Welcome to tutorial number 11 of NS2. Uh, in this tutorial, we are going to learn how to introduce channel error rate on wired link. Uh, let us begin. All right, I've got I've got a brand new example here for you. All right, this is an example of a wired network with six nodes. And currently uh, we have three sources and a sink. Let me show you the network here. Again, if you need uh, the sample file, you can download it from the link in the description. All right, this is the network. This is the kind of network that I have designed to illustrate this problem. I have um, uh, three sources, zero, one, and two. And then I have two links. Uh, one link is from two, uh, three to four, which is a router to router link. And then we have four to five which is a router destination link. We can insert channel e error rate on any of the links. Now, before we actually insert this value in the script file, let me just tell you something about channel error rate. Uh, it is a representative of uh, the error on the channel. For example, if you would, um, if you would think of optical channel, you would think of it as a low loss link however if you think of a coaxial cable you would think of it as a high error link so it's just a representative of um, the error that you can implement on the link uh, again uh, everything is in our hands so we we just do it for the sake of evaluation so i have the code for setting up error model on link. For example, this is the code for setting up an error model on link N2 to N3. So you just define the loss module and you define the name of the loss module and then you set the rate here where 0, dot 0 would mean that the channel has no error at all. However, a complete 1 means an error in a, uh, completely erroneous channel. So that is how you insert this code. You just need to copy this code and paste it in your PCL file. Uh, but before we do that, let's just see how the network is behaving right now without any uh, insertion of channel error. If you have been watching the videos in this playlist in the previous tutorial, uh, I have exam uh, I have shown you an example of how uh, the Q length affects the performance of the network. Uh, but currently, you can see that um, the there is a delay, of course, between link three and four, which is pretty large. But other than that, uh, this drop in the packet um, is the cause of a very small Q length specified at node number 4 because uh, we have a Q length of approximately 15 here at node 3 so it is doing, it is behaving pretty well. So um, as you can see nothing, nothing different is happening 
so we can close this let's close this and let us insert the code for channel error rate on on link two and link two and three so this is the link where we bring the All right, so if you want uh, the text file for this code, you can download it from the link in the description. Okay, I've kept the channel error rate to be 0.5. Okay, that's fairly large. Okay, let's see if it makes any difference at all. Okay. Now you see the packets being dropped at the node 3, which is actually node 2 in the TCL file. Okay, now if we uh, let this run for a while and then we analyze the packet loss it should give us a clear picture of what is happening what has happened actually let's make it right let's save it All right, if we uh, insert a reasonably lower value of uh, channel error rate, this is going to make a little change. network all right now you can see some packets are being dropped here but they they are reaching at node 4 and eventually reaching the node 5 also and some queue is being made here but earlier when we were keeping the channel error rate at, at a very very high super high rate like 0 0.8 0 0.7 or closer to 1 which is very RNS channel uh, everything was being dropped here so uh, that is how you can insert channel error rate and uh, then you can analyze the difference um, between the transmission and the performance parameters hope this uh, tutorial helps and if it does click on the like share or comment all right and uh, you have a very good day bye bye